I welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I explain you the meaning of fluid power engineering subject. Now, when you start the reading subject, you just clear the name of the subject. So, in this subject name, it is a three words. First one is the fluid, second one is the power and third one is the engineering. So you first understand all these three words. So just I explain you first the meaning of the fluid. What is a fluid? The fluid is a substance that continuously deforms under the applied shear stress or an external force. The fluid is generally three types. It may be liquid, it may be gas and it may be plasma. So what is the meaning of liquid? Liquid means it is a water, it is a oil or any other liquids. What is the meaning of gas? Gases means it may be air, it may be carbon dioxide, it may be nitrogen, it may be organs. That is the number of gases. And third one is the plasma. So majority of student is talking that the fluid means only liquid. But fluid does not mean it is a liquid. It is a liquid, it may be gas and it may be the plasma. Now, so it must be clear, fluid means not only liquid, it may be liquid or it may be gas. Second word is the power. The meaning of power means rate of doing work. Okay. So, we are going to produce or absorb some power by using the fluids. Means, either using a liquid or gas we are going to produce power means we are produce the work or we supply the work to the devices next what is the engineering engineering is the branch of science and technology concerns with the design building and use of engines machines and structures so engineering means it is a branch of science in which you are studying, you are modifying the different devices, different structures and different machines. So these are the separate words. Now what is the complete meaning of fluid power engineering? So first I tell you the meaning of fluid power. Fluid power means use of the fluid under the pressure. Okay. Fluid means we are using the liquid or gas. By using this liquid or gas, we are generate the power we control the power or we transmit the power okay and the fluid is subdivided in the two category first one is the hydraulics and second one is the pneumatics so hydraulic means when using a liquid such as a mineral or or a waters so when using the liquid or waters or mineraloids this system is called the hydraulic systems and another one is the pneumatic systems pneumatic system using the gas such as air or other gases okay so these are the difference between hydraulics and pneumatics when we use the liquid it is hydraulic system and when we using the air or gas then it is known as the pneumatic system so in this subject we are studying the system that is based on hydraulics as well as the pneumatics now what is the complete meaning fluid power engineering fluid power engineering is a branch of mechanical engineering in which we are studying the devices which run on the basis of liquid and gases and what is the function of these devices this device either produce the power either control the power either transmit the power or absorb the powers okay so that are different types of devices so just i give you the introductions of various devices so in this fluid power engineering generally we are studying the three devices first one is the turbine okay so turbine is a mechanical device in which we supplied the hydraulic energy means we supplied the liquid that is the water and this water energy is converted into the mechanical energy of the sub so it is known as the turbine and it is the hydraulic device because we use the liquid second one is the pump pump is also a 
hydraulic device because pump is used to transmit the water from one place to another place or the low head to high head in which what is the inlet inlet is mechanical energy inlet is electrical energy to the motor motor is converted mechanical energy and this mechanical energy is converted at the hydraulic energy at that outlet in turbine it is opposite in turbine we supply hydraulic energy and we getting the mechanical energy as a output in the pump we supplied mechanical energy and hydraulic energy is the output so turbine is a power producing device and pump is a power absorbing device third one is the compressors so compressor word is indicate when we divide the compressor in the two parts com plus press press means we are pressing the different gases and increasing its pressure it's called as the compressor so that is a device used to increase the pressure of air and gas it is known as the compressors so we are studying all three devices in the details so within our one to two month i will uploading the all the video of turbines pump and compressors for that i request to subscribe my channels and go to the playlist and watch all the videos in clear language and better understandings thank you for watching this video if you learn something then like my video subscribe my channels and share with your friend